Poseidon has been manufacturing diving equipment since 1958. We produce basically diving equipment for the recreational diving market and the technical diving market. Most of the conventional uh, mouthpieces that are available in the market are using wheels and knobs uh, in order for the diver to be able to optimize the breathing resistance or the inhalation resistance while going deeper. But we think that the diving equipment should just be there. I mean, it should function regardless of depth, temperature, gas density, and the diver should not be the one who regulates the gas. It's the regulator who should work as a regulator. So you should basically have something that works regardless of depth. The best example would probably be the extreme regulator. If we wouldn't have solid works, I think the product development cost would probably be increased by $200,000. The first files uh, were, that were used in the mouthpiece were actually uh, first constructed in Pro-E, but as we had problems with the surface modeling and SOLIDWORKS license was uh, purchased, we started working with SOLIDWORKS. And then the model was actually exported through an IGS file to SOLIDWORKS. The surface modeling problem was solved and we got excellent pictures by uh, using PhotoWorks. I would recommend SOLIDWORKS due to a simple fact which is actual the compatibility with the different products and the ability uh, to satisfy the designers' uh, needs and the engineering needs at the same time, at the very high-end levels. We can today use the same program when applying new design to a breathing regulator or to a diving mask. We can use the same program when we engineer the product, when we test it, and the same program can be used for marketing like rendering pictures, uh, animations, and then the possibility of actually taking parts and assemblies and sending it to suppliers using probably e-drawings if they don't have SOLIDWORKS themselves in order to communicate before the production itself. When you have an idea, the advantage of SOLIDWORKS is being able just to sit down and sketch something onto the computer directly, which can basically be emailed to the designer or to one of my engineers to check the construction. And if it works, you can still use the original file that you probably created just by sketching something and continue and develop it at different levels. One level, the uh, designer makes sure it looks good. On the other hand, the engineer makes sure that all the tolerances are right using the same tool. And that's more than you can say while using Pro-E you're not able to use the pro their products at the same way that you can use SOLIDWORKS.